Hey, it, excuse me. It's Sunday, August 4th, 2019, and we are coming to you from one of the parking lots at uh, Central Stadium, the Braves. Hey, look, we have a good background. <laughs> um, this is an early, quick video because I am on my way to the airport. Um, I've got to fly home and go. Oh, don't even. Oh, that's just because you're not mushy. I've got to fly home and go to work tomorrow morning while these two go up to Indianapolis to DCI semifinals Yay. that are happening on Thursday. Um, so very quick recap, uh, we left out of South Carolina this morning at 7 o'clock, Joe drove most of the way through and then hit a pretty harsh uh, rainstorm. So we pulled out for what, about half an hour? Yeah, I probably got that. Took a nap, waited for the weather to subside, and then rolled in here um, around 11.30, and I'll let Joe tell this parking story. Oh, a short version. We paid for RV parking through the Braves organization, and we get to the spot, to the, to the lot where we were told to go, and, oh, um, well, we don't accommodate your vehicle here. No, go back. It was all because they didn't want to move a sign. Well, yeah, I asked them to move the sign so I could make the turn. It's kind of hard to turn a 33-foot vehicle when they've got it set up for cars. Um, and they said, oh, no, you can make it, you can make it. So finally, a supervisor comes over and he says, you know, we can't accommodate your vehicles here. I said, well, why is there a bus here? Oh, it's broke down. Even though it's parked perfectly. Anyway, I went and turned around and tried to get out of the lot and almost hit somebody with the mirror because she refused to move. We ended up coming over to the other lot and no problem, very nice person. We parked and we actually Ubered from the parking lot to the stadium because it's a mile uphill. We didn't do it. Yeah, that was not gonna happen. Um, so yeah, the the people here at Lot 35 were lovely. Um, Lot 29 was another story. Yeah, that was really bad. So went to the game, the stadium was nice. It wasn't the best, it wasn't the worst we've seen on the trip as far as I'm concerned. Um, uh, the game got exciting at the end where it was tied up, but then that's when I need to hightail it back to the RV and take a quick shower, which is why I look like this. You were <laughs> bad luck when you left. Huh? You were bad luck when you left. Apparently I was. Oh, and during the game, well, I'll tell, I'll, I'll, I'll tell that in a minute. Um, and so I came back in pedicab and jumped in the shower. It was a cold shower. You wouldn't know about my face, but it was a totally cold shower. It was a cold shower? Yeah. I was hot. Because she wanted to. And so, and then um, apparently 10 minutes, 15 minutes after I left, the game was over. Yep. And the boys came back in a pedicab also. But it actually worked because there's no way all three of us could have gotten into one pedicab. So we had to take two anyway. It was yeah, fine. We're too big to sit on each other's laps. Yeah. Even Jonathan. No, you two are sitting on the lap. I'm giving my own seat. <laughs> so, real quick, high and low, because I've got to get jamming to the airport. Um, I'm going to go first. Uh, my high. Did I have a high yes. today? What was my high? I guess it was Centrist Park. It was. Oh, no, no. The high was petting the Golden Doodle that we oh, had. That's that, true. that we saw in front of. Huh? The yeah, Labrador's a Labrador. Sorry, Labradoodle in front of the park. That was that was my high point. My low point was when I perfectly balanced a tray of two sandwiches, a hot dog, chips, and a large soda, which Jonathan didn't bring the cup back. Yes, he did. Oh, he yes, did. did. Um, and a large yes, soda and a water in my pocket. I brought it all the way back from two concession stands and a condiment stand, all the way down to our seats. Joe takes it. And what does Joe do? He spills it. All over himself and all over me, mustard everywhere. You make him sad. <laughs> it's okay. I'm going to take the clothes home and I'm going to wash them. They'll be fine. All right. So. High point. Um, bottom half of the ninth inning. Really exciting part of the game. Low point. Let's see. Rain. Lot 29. Um, yeah, that's it. Never go to lot 29 at, at, if you're out of land to break game. Jonathan, high and low. 
Well, my high point was seeing the last baseball game of my trip, the ninth inning, because I got to see Freddie Freeman and Ronald Cunha hit a 2 1 home run and tie it up. And lot 35, those people were nice. Yes. Um, and I have some low points. Um, lot 29, um, the top half of the 10th inning when the Cincinnati Reds hit a 3 1 home run. And Bottom out the inning, the Braves are swinging everything. So, yeah, it was great. Okay. So, this is the last video you will see with the three of us. It will just be the two of us next. If they actually remember to do we it. We will do it. Right. So, that's it. See you Bye later. Nora. I'm out. Bye.